Right now, there are only two dental schools in the entire state, but a third is set to open here in Knoxville soon. Lincoln Memorial University's new College of Dental Medicine is set to open this fall. Tanya's reporter Jacinta Render has a first look at the classrooms and how the new college addresses a bigger issue in Tennessee. Jacinta. John Robin data shows there are just not enough dentists in Tennessee. There are dental care disparities in East Tennessee and rural Appalachia. The dean says having a dental school here gives students in the region the opportunity to attend college closer to home and expands dental care. We have about half the number of required dentists per 100,000 patients. Dr. Denise Therese Cook, the Dean of LMU's College of Dental Medicine, says the pandemic made things worse. The practices have have closed and new dentists aren't coming in and they're not taking taking over those practices. So uh, the problem becomes more and more detrimental for the community. LMU's dental school welcomes all students to the program. They hope people interested in dentistry nearby will take full advantage. Our focus group is, you know, students in the Appalachia and East Tennessee area. And a lot of the students live in, they will commute back and forth to dental school, which gives them, like I said, it, it gives them the support of being at home. The classrooms will have brand new technology and all of the tools needed to practice dental work, all located at LMU's tower at the old St. Mary's Hospital site in North Knoxville. Classes will not start until September 12th, but there are already 80 students on the roster lined up for this fall. They are also getting a head start. So it just gives them a leg up into dentistry knowing terminology. There will be several areas of study ranging from basic dental hygiene to orthodontics. It is a three year program and it costs about $65,000 a year. There are scholarships available. Very welcome and needed program. Jacinta, thank you.